Hey guys, what's going on? What's going on? Street Trade coming at you with uh, with another trade lesson video for everybody looking at hourly chart of Caesars Entertainment Corporation Consumer Cyclical Sector CZR. Let's get right into it. So we actually uh, we had this on our weekly going into this week's session with the number of uh, I think we had like ten or eleven going into the session into the week session. Um, majority of them were uh, moves to the downside. Obviously, there's no, <laughs> there's no surprise that these guys are under some pretty significant selling pressure. Obviously, the boys, uh, there's interesting the way uh, Smart Money plays it, um, where they obviously you know, breach uh, obvious levels, just a trap, and then um, you know they play around that level whether they're uh, getting in or getting out, try to clear the books, and then their the move continues. So you can see that from uh, the beginning of October. And they brought it right back down to the pivot of what middle of August. So we saw that uh, dead cat coming back down um, this past weekend, and that's what put it on watch. Uh, yesterday, going into the uh, pre market, uh, everything was lining up. We had a continuation plus gap down. So everything was kind of lined up for more pain. So there was key levels, obviously, where price wanted to go, and, and that's where uh, we have our targets. We have our, obviously, if this, then that, things happen. We need to see particular situations that um, the market needs to show us before we put on risk. So we end up getting involved at a particular time, or we mostly get in um, after the bell. Not at the bell, but uh, in that uh, time frame. And we ended up getting stopped out first uh, first entry, and um, we weren't wrong. It was just early, you know. We talk about it all the time. Majority of the times, you're not going to be wrong if you understand how market structure works and how you know price moves and things like that. So we weren't wrong. It was just early. Took the L, took a step back, got back in when it proved to us that we were just early, and uh, we ended up taking it down. It was this fantastic fade to the downside, and well, you know, the market obviously fell. You know, continued selling off yesterday, so it helped as well but nonetheless this thing was dipping it was gonna def definitely gonna fade out so anyway let's get into how we traded to the downside all that good stuff levels let's get down to business